In this video, I'm going to show you how to install a third-party firmware to your Flipper Zero called Extreme. There's a lot of cool benefits, and I'll briefly go over them as we go through this video. If you're new to the channel, please leave a like and subscribe. I try to do these fast tutorials to help you so you can practice cybersecurity faster. Okay, first thing you do is Google Flipper Zero Extreme. Once you do that, just hit search. And it should be the first GitHub link that pops up. I'm going to put the link in the description. This way you guys don't have to fumble around to look for it. It'll make your life a little easier. All right, so direct your eyes to the middle right where it says releases. Click on that. And it gives you a little summary of everything that you would get with this firmware. Um, once you look at that, or you could just skip ahead to the web updater. Use that one. That's the fastest way to do it. No install necessary. Now, while your flipper is plugged into the computer, hit connect. It should pop up there. Then you're going to flash it over but before that you just go ahead you can look at everything that comes with it this is important before i tell you anything else do not unplug your flipper while it's doing the flashing it puts you at risk for breaking your device just leave it plugged in and when it's done it will tell you i'll even show you what it looks like when it's done toward the end of this video right out of the box with this firmware you get bluetooth bad usb you can get dark mode and also you have a Watch Dogs 2 theme which i really love that you're going to see toward the end of this video as well but this is what it looks like when you're doing the flashing on your device. Again, do not unplug it at this stage. Just let it do its thing and it'll tell you when it's done. Now, this is good to learn because you're going to be flashing and doing things like this with other devices when you're doing cybersecurity testing and projects. There's also other third-party firmware like Unleashed that is very popular that you can also install just like this. But with most things in life, it's just preference. So now you, it's done. So this is what it looks like when it's done. To give you a little like tutorial here, I'm just going to click through this stuff so you can see what it would look like and i just i love the ui on this job it just it's really nice it's very clean you like and there's a dark mode dimensions there and uh toward the end of it you'll see what it looks like when you change the theme to the watchdogs theme i just think it's so cool and again make sure you treat this vice with a lot of care because it's very fresh okay that's pretty much it that's how simple it is to uh, install this firmware to this device so there's that watchdog theme again instead of the dolphin you get the cool character there, and this is like the, look, the screen when you first turn it on. But if you like videos like this, short, fast uh, tutorials how to do stuff like this, let me know. Um, leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.